KPM. Hmm. Where did it go? Did I put it somewhere else? Hello, good morning. I'm hi. Inspector Zakia. Oh, so hi what's, Inspector. So what's going on here? Oh, okay, you see this bus? Uh-huh. There's only one of them. There's supposed to be two. One has gone missing. Oh, okay. So when was it last seen? It was last seen about 5 p.m. yesterday. Uh-huh. Ten minutes later, poof! It's missing! Gone. Gone. In just 10 minutes? In just 10 minutes. Oh, okay. So, I think I need the visitor list. Do you have the visitor, visitor list during ah, that hour? Here it is. Okay. Okay. So, let's call them. Mm -hmm. And then, I will try my very best to help you find the stolen bus. <gasps> Thank you so much, Inspector. Thank okay, you. Okay, let's go. Let's go. You are now watching level 2 on Diddy TV KPM together with me, Sean Steven, as your host. And for today, our lesson is English Year 6 with, of course, none other than Miss Zakia. Hi. Hi, Miss Zakia. How are you today? I'm good. How are you, Sean? I am wonderful. But before we proceed, we would also like to introduce our sign language interpreter of today, and that is Miss Rohaya. Hi, Miss Rohaya. And how are you today? Wonderful! Alright, back to Miss Zakia. Of course, uh, we know that there are also pupils who are joining us online, right? <laughs> Let's see who they are. Hi everyone! Could you kindly introduce them to all of us? Yes, okay. So, we have our first pupil, Nur Awadah Batrisha from uh, SK Felda Kahang Barat, Luang Johor. Hi Awadah! Hi! Alright, and the next one, we have Jill Dilane. She's mm -hmm. from SJKC Chonghua Kuala Punyu Sabah. Oh, hello. Hi, Jill. And the next one, we have uh, Muhammad Fitri from SK Bandar Baru Rawang Selangor. Hi, Fitri. Hi. And the last one, we have uh, Ahmad Adam Arifin uh, from uh, SK Saujana Indah, Nibong Tebal, P Kuala, Kuala, sorry, I'm sorry. Pulau Pinang. Ah, all right. Hi. Hello, everyone. From almost all corners of Malaysia. Yeah, we have from Johor, mm -hmm. uh, Sabah, mm -hmm. Selangor, and Pulau Pinang. All right. And is everyone ready for our lesson today? Give me a thumbs up if you are. Yes. All right. So, uh, Ms. Zakia, what exactly are we learning today? Okay, today we are going to actually mm -hmm. catch a robber. <gasps> Oh. Mm, we are going to catch a robber. Mm -hmm. Okay, so for this activity, for this lesson, mm -hmm. uh, we are going to do two skills. Yes. Listening and speaking skills. All right. Okay, so to start off, mm -hmm. I have some question for our pupils. Okay. Ah, now based on the short sketch we had just now, who can tell me what was missing from the museum? What was missing from the museum? Anyone? Can you please raise your hand? From the short sketch just now. Yes, Adam. A vase. A vase. Yes. A vase was missing. Very good. Mm -hmm. Okay, now, the second question, when was it last seen? Ah, we talk about it, right? Yes, that's so right. So, when was it last seen? Okay, okay, Jill. Jill wants to give it a try. Mm -hmm. At 5 o'clock. At 5 o'clock. Yes, yes, very good. Mm -hmm. At 5 o'clock. And the last question, when was it missing? Awada, is it? Okay, Awada, okay. At 10 minutes past 5. 10 minutes past 5. Yes. yes, you said 10 minutes later. That's right. Yes, that's correct. Mm -hmm. Very good. Okay, let's continue our lesson. Okay. Okay, so we are going to find out what's missing. Mm -hmm. Okay, now what's missing for this activity, uh, I'm going to show you two pictures okay. of the same room. Mm -hmm. Two pictures of the same room. But there are differences between these two pictures. Okay. So our pupils need to find out what are the differences. All right. Ah, so are you guys ready, kids? Okay, so if you're ready, give me thumbs up. 
All right, so let me show you the first picture. Okay. Now, the first picture, let's look at the time. Hmm. What does the time, the time show, Sean? Um, 4.30. 4.30, okay. Mm -hmm. And then look at the museum room there. Ah, what okay. do we have there? We have vases, mm -hmm. we have uh, dinosaur eggs, mm -hmm. we have dinosaur skeleton, okay. dinosaur skull, mm -hmm. we have two human sculptures, okay. uh, we have old paintings there. Okay. Very beautiful paintings behind there, right? Yes. Now, let's look at the second picture. Mm -hmm. Now, <gasps> what is the time? The time is 5 p.m. 5 p.m. 5 o'clock. Mm -hmm. 5 o'clock. But look at the surrounding. Oh, ah. that is a big difference there. Yeah. Okay, we can see something, uh, some things are missing there. Yes. Okay, so let's find out. Mm -hmm. Now, can you tell me what's missing, Sean? Okay, um, the first thing that I notice is a human sculpture. A human sculpture, okay. A human sculpture. Hmm? Now, who would like to give it a try for the second thing that is missing? Okay, Adam? A dinosaur egg. The dinosaur egg, a dinosaur Ah, egg. yes. Ah. Okay, uh, the next one, who would like to give it a try? What's missing? Okay, Fitri. A painting. A painting? <coughs> ah. A painting. Mm -hmm. Okay, the next one. Okay, Awada. A dinosaur skull. A dinosaur skull. Oh. Ah. And then hey. the last one, I think we have the last one. Jill, would you like to give it a try? A vase. A vase. Aha. A vase. Okay, so these are the missing items from the museum room. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's check our pupils' answers. Okay. Okay, for this one, let's look at the answers. Ah. Oh. Okay, let's check. Mm -hmm. Do we have, uh, let's start from the first one, from the left. Okay. What do we have there? A vase. A vase. We have a vase? Yes. yes excellent. Mm -hmm. The next one we have? Um, a painting, right? Yes, correct. A painting, yes. There's a painting. And mm -hmm. then next one? A dinosaur egg. A dinosaur egg is missing. Two, yeah. And what else? Um, the, uh, what we call dinosaur skull. The dinosaur skull. And the last one we have? My answer, the human skull. Oh, you answered that? Yes. Okay, so <laughs> I think everyone has got the correct answer for what's missing there. Well done. Wow, good job everyone. Good job. All right. Um, so also, I think because they answer correctly, yes. do we get a reward? Yes. Let's reward them. Each one of them, one star. One star for everyone. Let me just get it out here. Wonderful job, everyone. I think they really paid attention yes. to you know the pictures. So, so one star for Awada. Awada. One star for Jill. Another for Fitri. And last but not least for. And, uh, well yes. done, everyone. I think everyone deserves a short break. Don't go anywhere. Going back, uh, going to be back to you right after our break here at Didi TV KPM. Didi TV KPM. Didi TV KPM. And we are back. Well, lesson for today is English Year 6 together with Miss Zakia. All right, Miss Zakia, shall we continue? Yes, we shall continue our lesson. Mm -hmm. Now, in every robbery situation, yes. there must be suspects. Ah, yes. Okay, suspects are the people who were at the place mm -hmm. and then we assume that one of them must be the robber. Okay. So we want to catch the robber, right? Yes. So before we catch the robber, we need to actually... Uh, ask these suspects. Mm -hmm. So we need to find out what were they doing. So that's what we are going to do. Okay. What were they doing? So to continue with our lesson, mm -hmm. I'm going to explain a little bit about past continuous tense. I'm All going right. to introduce past continuous tense. Mm -hmm. Now, past continuous tense is uh, an ongoing action. An ongoing action that happened in the past. That happened in the past. Mm -hmm. uh, the action was continuous, was ongoing. Okay, okay now, uh, let's look at some examples. Now, the left column, we have simple past and the, the, the right column is the past continuous tense. The, the left column, the first example, we have, we had a slice of pizza last night. Mm -hmm. Had a pizza of, uh, a, a, 
a slice of pizza last night. Had is the the action okay. which happened in the past. Mm -hmm. That is very simple. But when we want to talk about the action was continuous, mm -hmm. was ongoing, so we change it into were having. Ah. We were having a slice of pizza last night when our cousins came. So mm. when your cousin, when our cousins came, uh, the the action of having the pizza was ongoing. Okay. Uh, so that's why we use were having. I see. Now let's look at the second example. We have she bought a birthday present yesterday. Bought is the action in the past. Okay. A very simple one. But when we want to uh, talk about uh, the action that was ongoing, so we have to change it into she was buying a birthday present yesterday at the time of the robbery. So the action of buying the birthday present was ongoing when uh, during the uh, the time of the robbery. Yes. Okay. And then the third example we have he did a research about dinosaur eggs last week. Mm -hmm. So did is the verb the action word. But when we want to talk about the action of doing it uh, uh, as uh, on, as ongoing. Yes. So we have to change it into he was doing a research about dinosaur eggs last week at the time of the robbery. Mm -hmm. Now, if you look at the three examples there, we have we were having, yeah. she was buying, he was doing. So what this, what's the difference between were and was? Were is used when uh, the subject is more than one. Okay. Like we, mm -hmm. it's more than one person. But was is used when the subject is singular, one person only. She was buying, she is only one person. Mm -hmm. Okay, so now, let's continue. I'm going to show you some more examples. Now, the simple present tense we have uh, have, and the simple past is had. But when you want to change it into past continuous, it becomes having. You just change into uh, have and then you change it into having, yeah. ing. And then we have buy becomes buying, draw becomes drawing, look becomes looking and admire becomes admiring. And don't forget, we have to use was and were. So it would be was having, were having or was buying, were buying, was drawing, were drawing. Was looking, were looking, was, was admiring and were admiring. Okay. Okay, so why do I introduce this? Now, the pupils will need to use this for our lesson. Aha, ah, all right. They need to explain what they were doing, what the suspects were doing using this past continuous tense. Okay, so right. are you guys ready? Now, we are going to do a listening activity here. Okay. And this listening activity, we have two parts. All right. So the first part, our pupils, we need to listen mm -hmm. and then they need to answer the question. Now, they need to find out what these people were doing. We have six suspects. Okay. We have Pat Plum, mm -hmm. Lucy Specks, Tim Tall, Miss Pepper, Sue Snaps and Dr. Green. So, are you guys ready? If you are ready, show me thumbs up. Yeah. Okay, good. All right. So, I think uh, we are ready for our first part. Let's play our first part. Track 2.17. Unit 10. Lesson 1. Activity 2. The robbery. You're all here because there was a robbery at the museum yesterday. We're all suspects, aren't we, Inspector? Yes, you are. I'm sorry. A valuable dinosaur egg is missing from the museum. Someone stole it yesterday evening. That's terrible. You were the only visitors in the museum at the time of the robbery. I'm taking statements about where you all were at five o'clock. Mr. Plump, where were you? I was drawing hieroglyphics in the Egyptian room. It's my favourite hobby. Collecting dinosaur eggs is also one of your hobbies, isn't it? That's not a crime, is it? <clears throat> Miss Spex, the CCTV camera shows you leaving the museum with a large bag at five o'clock. Yes, it was my brother's birthday. I bought him a present in the museum shop. I can prove it. Here's the receipt showing what I bought. Okay, thank you. Now, who's next? Uh, Tim, isn't it? Yes, Inspector. I was at the museum on a school trip. But the trip ended at four o'clock. Why were you still here at five o'clock? I can answer that, Inspector. Tim lost his school bag and went to find it. Then he got lost, 
I went to look for him and found him in the Chinese room at five o'clock. Hmm. That's the end for our first part. So I think our pupils have got the answers. Now, who can tell me what was Pet Plum doing at the time of the robbery? Okay, Fitri. He was broke. He was drawing hieroglyphics in the Egyptian room. Ah, he was drawing the hieroglyphics drawing in mm -hmm. the Egyptian room. Let's check the answer. Is it correct? Yes. yes. Good job, so Petri. Done. Yeah. Okay. Our second question: mm -hmm. What was Lucy Specks doing at the time of the robbery? Who wants to give it a try? You can raise your hand if you want to try. Lucy Specks. What was Lucy Specks doing? Anyone? Okay. Okay, Adam. Lucy Specks was buying a birthday present at the museum shop. Ah, Lucy Specks was buying a birthday present at the museum shop. Let's check the answer. Is it correct? Yes, yeah. she was buying a birthday present in the museum shop. Good job, Adam. Okay, who wants to try the third one? What was Tim Tall doing at the time of the robbery? Tim Tall. What happened Tim, to Tim Tall was searching for his school bag and and he was lost in the museum. Ah, mm -hmm. he was searching for his school bag. He yes. was searching. Is it true? Let's check the answer. Yes, yeah. he was searching for his school bag and got lost in the museum. All right. Now, the last one we have Miss Pepper. Okay, what was Miss Pepper doing at the time of the robbery? Okay, who wants to give it a try? She was eh. She was looking for Tim Tall in the Chinese room. She yes. was looking for Tim Tall, mm -hmm. yeah, because Miss Pepper was the teacher, right? Yes. Okay, so let's check the answer. Yes, she was looking for Tim Tall in the Chinese room. Good job, everyone. Okay, don't worry, Awada, you can try for the second part. Mm -hmm. Okay, for the second part, I think our pupils is ready. Our pupils are ready. Let's listen to the audio. Okay, what about you, Miss Snaps? I was in the restoration room looking at some old paintings. Did anyone see you? Yes, I talked to the museum guard. He saw me go in at quarter to five and leave twenty minutes later. How interesting. Then, Dr. Green, it seems that you were the only person who was in the dinosaur room at five o'clock yesterday. Yes, I was there all afternoon. I was doing some research on dinosaur eggs, but I didn't steal the egg. He's lying, Inspector. He was the only one there. He must be the thief. Actually, Miss Specks, Dr. Green is not the thief. Really? How do you know? Because the egg wasn't in the dinosaur room at five o'clock. Mm. It was in the restoration room for cleaning. And that's when Miss Snaps stole it. <gasps> I didn't steal it. I only borrowed it. I wanted to take a photograph of it in my garden for a magazine. I was going to put it back today, but I haven't had time yet. Look, here it is. Congratulations, Inspector. You've solved the crime. Can we all go home now? Yes, you can. Except for you, Miss Snaps. You'll have to come with me. Mm. Oh, excellent. Uh, it's exciting, right? Very exciting. Oh, we just found out who's the robber. Mm -hmm. Okay, now it's time for our kids to answer the question. We have two last questions, actually. Yes. Okay, who would like to give it a try? What was Sue Snaps doing at the time of the robbery? Okay, Jill. Jill. She was admiring the old paintings in the restoration room. Ah, she was looking, admiring, okay, it's the same thing. She mm -hmm. was looking at some old paintings in the restoration room. Mm -hmm. Good job. Okay, I think the last one, uh, let's give it uh, Awada a chance. Yes. Okay, Awada, what was Dr. Green doing at the time of the robbery? He was doing some research on dinosaur eggs in the dinosaur room. Ah, let's check the answer. Yes, he was doing some research on dinosaur eggs in the dinosaur room. Good job. So I think everyone has done an excellent
excellent job. Yes. So let's let's reward each one of them a star each. Yes, that's right. I got the stars over here. I'm going to stick them on the reward chart. In the meantime, don't go anywhere. I'm going to take a short break. Back to you after this on Didit TV KPM. Didit TV KPM. TV KPM. Welcome back. You are now watching Level 2 on Didit TV KPM where our lesson for today is English Year 6 with, of course, none other than Miss Zakia. So, Miss Zakia, why am I wearing this badge? Ah, because uh, now we are going to find out who's trouble and we're going to do a role play. Aha. And I have promoted you to become the inspector. Yes, thank you so much. <laughs> <laughs> I'm ready. Okay, for this activity, I need our pupils to open the envelope and read the information about yourself. Ah, and among them, there is a robber. <gasps> among them, there is a robber. Mm -hmm. Okay, they are the suspects, but among them, there is a robber. And then the inspector, which is you, mm -hmm. will ask you some questions. And the pupils will need to answer the questions using the information given, only using past continuous tense. Okay. Ah, and then, please don't tell anyone who is the real you. Mm -hmm. Nobody knows. Mm -hmm. And then, let's catch the robber together. Alright. Okay, are you guys ready? Okay, let's start with... Me, uh, the, inspector. the inspector. Okay. You're all here because there was a robbery at the museum yesterday evening. Someone stole an old and expensive Egyptian, va uh, Egyptian vase. I'm sorry, but you are all the suspects because you were the only visitors in the museum at the time of the robbery. I'm taking statements about where you were all, uh, where you all were at five o'clock. So here we go, Fitri. What were you doing at the time of the robbery? Oh, I was taking note about dinosaur in the dinosaur room. Hmm, okay, okay. What about you, Jill? What were you doing then? Oh, I was studying the paintings in the restoration room. Hmm, okay, I'll take note of that. Uh, what were you doing at 5 o'clock in the evening yesterday, Adam? 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 Well... Well, I was learning the traditional language in the Chinese room. Okay, all right, thank you so much. And now, Awada, please tell me about what were you doing at the time of the robbery? I was looking at the vases in the Egyptian room. Hmm, okay, now let's continue. What were you wearing yesterday at the museum, Adam? Oh. I was wearing a white t-shirt, jeans, and sneakers. Okay, okay. Thank you very much, Adam. And uh, Awada, please tell me what were you wearing yesterday? I was wearing a satin dress and heels. Aha, uh -huh, okay. And Jill, what about you? I was wearing a red dress with a leather jacket and heels. Okay, now it's your turn, Fitri. What were you wearing yesterday during your visit at the museum? I wearing I was wearing a suit and a leather shoes. Okay, okay. Now that I've got all your statements, it's time for me to catch the robber. All right. Based on your statements, I have two final suspects whom I think is the robber. The robber was wearing a pair of heels at the time of the robbery. You have anything to say for yourselves? Who was wearing a pair of heels? Yes. I think if I'm not mistaken, it is Awada as well as Jill. Oh, let's see. Hmm. Do you have to say something, Jill and Awada? That must be either me or Awada. Mm -hmm. It's not me. I was in the restoration room. The vase was in the Egyptian room. It must be Awada. Mm -hmm. Okay, Awada? Not me. I was there, but I didn't steal it. I don't like vases. 
Mm. All right. Don't worry, Awada. I know you're not the robber. The vase was never in the Egyptian room. It was taken to the restoration room for cleaning that day. Ah, so? But the person in the restoration room of the time of the robbery was Jill. You are right, Inspector. The robber is Jill, isn't it? <laughs> yes, you're right. Jill stole the vase. I'm sorry, I, I didn't mean to steal it. I only borrowed it yesterday to take some photos of it in my living room. I was planning to return it today. The vase is in my bag. <laughs> Thank you everyone for your cooperation. All of you can go home except for you, Jill. You, come with me. Ah, excellent. Well done, everyone. So we have caught the robber. Who's yes. the robber? It is Jill. It's Jill. Okay. All right. So I think we should reward each one of them mm -hmm. a star. That's right. Congratulations, a everyone. Job. They you managed to use mm -hmm. past continuous tense. Yes, that's mm. right. All right. So while I'm sticking the, 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 uh, the stars, could you also give us a brief summary of our lesson today? Okay, so uh, the summary of our lesson today, the kids were doing listening and, and speaking activities mm -hmm. and they were using uh, past continuous tense to explain about the action that happened in the past, All which right. was excellent. Well done, everyone. What about the overall performance of our pupils today? Uh, they had done a wonderful job. They managed to uh, answer all the questions correctly. All Good right. job. Well done. Well done, everyone. For those of you watching at home, if you'd like to get some enhancement exercises, from where can they get it? Okay, so uh, our pupils at home can go to the Del Delima KPM website to uh, to check on the lessons, uh, the learning materials today, mm -hmm. and they can also do the uh, enrichment activities provided in the website. All right, thank you so much once again, Ms. Uh, Zakia, for our lesson for today, and for those of you watching. Hopefully, it's been beneficial to all of you, and we'll see you next time in our next class. Till then, take care and bye. Bye. Um, actually, uh, Sean, I have some questions to our pupils, actually. Oh, okay. Ah, okay. I hope our pupils are not shocked. Um, have you been to a museum? I think everyone has been to a museum, right? Yeah. So, what else can you can you find in the museum? Mm. Ah, what else can we find in the museum besides vase, the dinosaur skeletons? Okay, Adam. A sculpture. A sculpture. Uh -huh. Uh-huh. What else? Okay, Jill? The traditional clothes. The traditional clothes, okay. Yes, yes right. yeah, we can find traditional clothes in the museum. Yes, what right. else can we find in the tradition uh, in the museum? Okay, Awada? The old coins. Old, old coins, coins. Yeah. yeah. People in the past, they are not using the same coins that we have now. Right. The money. Okay. Okay, what else? Petri? Anything else? No. <laughs> no? <laughs> what do you think? Clue. I think old paintings. Definitely old paintings. Old paintings, yeah, old paintings. What about what about this Fitri in the past? Weapons? Sorry? Weapons, you say. Weapons? Ah, yeah, weapons. Old well. weapons. Very good. Well Excellent. Done. Good job. TV KPM